trouble on a soapbox right there on the front page. Community station confronts conflicts. This is basically an article which, which uh, talks about the problems that this very station that you're watching this show on has been having with uh, a, a few key programs, yeah. namely Pots, Pans, Pans, and Pot, which is a show by Eric Indiana, um, yeah. which, uh, which glorifying the responsible use of marijuana. Yeah, in cooking. Um, and uh, then also talking about this show, J&B on the Rocks, and I'll quote a little bit about Tuesday that. Tuesday nights at 11. <laughs> yeah. Two episodes of J&B on the Rocks were held by Michael White, the station director, recently because of material he considered too sexually explicit to live up to community standards. Now we're going to show you what those segments were right now. Or wait, I guess we probably shouldn't. Yeah, that, that, then this show too would be censored. censored. Yeah. The shows in question contained close-up shots of male genitalia, said J of J and B on the Rocks. To my mind, this is sexually explicit stuff, a violation of our policy as well as state and federal law, said Michael White, as he interviewed, as he viewed a male masturbation scene included in one of the held shows. Oh, wait a second. A male masturbation scene? So there was a guy masturbating in one of our episodes? Did no, you know that? Not, well, unless you... <laughs> only if you count stroking a, an artificial penis. Uh, oh, yeah, the thing with the guy with the dildo, yeah. Known as the dildo, yes. In, yeah. In common parlance. So he was stroking a, a, a piece a of dildo, plastic a that was shaped like a penis. Yeah. 